Hey everyone, Mortgage Nerd here. You get the pleasure of not seeing my face today. So, <laughs> all right, well, let's look at these numbers because today is July 15th, 10.20 a.m. that I'm filming this, and the Moderna vaccine showed very positive results. So we actually started the day with this number very negative. Remember, when mortgage bonds are down, when this is negative, that means that the interest rates are going up. Let's look at this recent history. Mortgage bonds were flat, 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 went up, went up, went up. I mean, really small differences. Maybe rates went down like an eighth of a percent from uh, the bottom and the top of this. This was last Friday. I locked in a bunch of people Friday morning before this alert was even issued. And mortgage bonds dropped hard. All these people are closing now with a better rate than what they are right now. I mean, it's really slight, these differences. It's not a big deal. Either way, mortgage bonds going back up is good for interest rates as we continue this. Even today, the Moderna vaccine... Uh, has positive news and stocks really started to rise. The S&P right here, the treasuries were up, which is also bad for rates. This was down, as you can see this morning, it was down eight basis points. And now we are seeing these mortgage bonds rise again. It's gonna be really difficult for rates to go up anytime soon, but when we truly have, truly have a vaccine, rates are going to skyrocket. So if you're looking to purchase, if you're looking to refinance, stop waiting get off the sidelines history shows every time rates jump up they jump up very very fast so you're gonna miss the boat phil stevenson mortgage nerd owner of ps mortgage lending thank you very much for tuning in